So for the spear warp in Temple Grounds, what I use to to make it easier is a uh, mouse setup. So I go to before I even start my run, I go to Solid Stronghold, and I use the holes for the the spiky pads to um, to get a setup. What I do is I position my mouse. I have my sensitivity set really low, so it's easy to line up. I set my mouse right around here, so this this area right here. So these four these four holes these four holes. Uh, I try to line up uh, the crosshair in a way that like, each line um, each line of the crosshair covers or hits one of the uh, one of the four holes. So yeah, something like this is probably what I would go for. Alright, so you are in Temple Grounds, ready to do the spare warp to, to the spider tomb. And you've done your thing, you've done your homework, you've gone to Solid Stronghold, you got the uh, setup for your mouse and stuff. So yeah, what you do is you walk up to this this side of the um, the stairs. If you run diagonally here, or like diagonally in terms of direction, but on the stick you just hold like straight up. Yeah, there's like a bit of an invisible wall here. Uh, and what you want to do is you want to line up on the edge of this thing. I'm just mentioning the wall because it can be useful to to um, run up against it to um, to slow Lara down and uh, be pretty precise. So, what you want to do is if you look at the um, the red circle under Lara, her player circle, uh, in the middle, like right between her legs, there's uh, a smaller circle, and Inside there again, there's like a little Pokeball looking thing. Like yin yang kind of style thing. Um, you want to make sure, you essentially want to make sure the Pokeball is off the edge here. In short, and um, make sure you only see the uh, the ring. So yeah, what you want to do is you want to hold your spear to slow Lara down, because she moves slower when she's aiming a spear. So you want to aim and then like slowly but surely you can like scoot your way off the edge here. So something like this is pretty good. This will probably be fun. And from here you want to do your thing. Uh, you want to, of course, never touch your mouse, but this is just for demonstration purposes. Um, you want to hold tab and press right trigger to, uh, to shoot your spear. And here one of four things is going gonna, is gonna to happen. Either this is gonna happen where you, the spear gets stuck in the like in the head on, on the stairs here. Um, of course, that's not gonna work. Uh, your spear will go like really far down and really far left. It's not gonna work. It's gonna go really far up and right. That's not gonna work. What you want is like somewhere in the middle here. And I'll what I'll do is I'll just I'll just tell you what you're going for like. <laughs> Roughly, like roughly this area, like the area that is covered by my um, by my crosshair, will work fine. If you look at the very top of the crosshair, something along this this seam right here, this like little crack here, it's gonna be good. Something down here is gonna be fine. Um, you have a little little bit of leeway, but um, but it's still pretty precise. So what I'll do is I'll uh, I'll just show you a bunch of successful attempts. And um, and you can uh, you can just have a look and see if you can find something that works for you. So yeah, after you do your thing, you throw your spear and it ends up somewhere. Like that's of course not gonna work, but um, yeah, let's just pretend that was fun. What I do is I run up into this corner, and I aim pretty much straight towards the uh, directly towards the door, because when I throw the spear, it ends up like this, like somewhat in the wall. Um, if you aim too much towards the corner, this most, most of the time happens, where you get the spear you get is like really far out, and it, it can be hard to, hard to work with. Uh, if you end up with a spear like that, you can just run in and throw another spear and do like this, and then while you're jumping towards the spear, just keep running towards the wall, and you'll end up on top of the spear. Okay, I'll just remove these now. 
simplicity. So yeah, run in towards the wall, throw the spear, get on the spear, face towards the, the end of the spear, basic spear warp stuff, press B and double tap A or however you like to do your spear warps. And then when you end up on the spear inside the tomb, um, let's just pretend that's this this spear for this uh, for the sake of explanation and showing. What I do is I just tap right, so she faces a different direction, and then I press B to climb down into the loading zone. Uh, another thing that can happen is that your spear is kind of weird, like it's kind of off. Uh, it'll still work, but it's kind of off. And what will happen is like something like this, where you you see she does the like the, the flailing arms and the super slow slow down, and she does a really slow and really high jump. And she ends up on a spear that's like further further over here, like further to the left or something. I'm not actually sure where the spear is because of course, of course you can't see it, but yeah, it's it's a different different position, is all the whole point. Um so if you see the big jump and the big slow jump and stuff like that, um all you need to do is hold down to the left and just jump. In this case she's gonna jump to the spear, so it's gonna be kind of awkward, but yeah. Very simple stuff. Like, again, just to, let's just pretend this is the spear that I'm talking about after you get the big jump. So yeah, just all jump jump down left and um, and you'll hit the load zone. So yeah, now let me show you just a bunch of um, a bunch of successful attempts at this and then you can see what you get out of it. Hopefully it helps. <laughs> 